Oh. Really good game here at 1 o'clock. Let's move to a game that I think is going to be at a slow pace. That's the Indianapolis Colts and the Miami Dolphins. Carson Wentz, probably a little bit better wear and tear this week than what we saw last week. Actually surprised he played, but he gutted it out, but they still lost the game. Jacoby Brissett was okay in that game. They got out early, got a couple turnovers, weren't able to keep the lead. Brian Flores kicking field goals in overtime, which is a questionable decision. They end up losing that game, but they're a slight favorite. All through at Pinnacle, minus 1.5. FanDuel, minus 1.5. Some twos here in New Jersey. I don't see big plays in this game either way around. There's a lot of injuries there to the Colts. It's one of those things where they just got injured in training camp and looks like they're going to stay injured for the 2021 season. I do see a low-scoring game. I can't necessarily go with the Indianapolis Colts in this game, even though they've been in all three games that they played. I just trust that on the road. I don't know where the big plays are coming from for the Colts. I think the Miami Dolphins can manage their way around this one. Open over, excuse me, the over under opened up at 45 and a half. That's down to 42 and a half across the board here. And you know what, Kyle? I agree with that. I I agree with it too. And this one's tough. I know it came across on the screen. You know, my pick is the Colts. If you're going to bet this game, don't bet this game now. You need to watch this injury report throughout the week because there's a lot of big-time players on this Colts team who have not practiced all week. I mean, Quiddy Pay and Darius Leonard, and some of these big-time hitters in that Colts defense. So the Dolphins could be a little bit sneaky here as a home dog. Uh, again, favorite, I would wait. Yeah. There are, excuse me, as the home favorite, but a slight home favorite, very, very slight yeah. home favorite. But the, the, there's certainly a potential here for them to win. Again, the Colts, Jonathan, the, the problem with the Dolphins is they can't stop the run. So you're going to see a ton of Jonathan Taylor. We saw the news, Marlon yeah. Max, they're going to trade Marlon Mack away. So it's going to be Naheem Hines and Jonathan Taylor. Allowed the second most fantasy points to opposing running backs through the first three weeks of the season. Uh, that's the way this is going to get done. I agree. I'd probably lean the under. Do I have the balls to take an under 42 and a half in the NFL? Absolutely not. Will I be betting this game in any way, shape or form? Absolutely not. It's tough. Uh, it's so tough. Although I could be roped in. You start flashing those 19 through the Colts again. I know and I'm gonna it. I it, know. And I'm going to have a, a first thing in the fourth quarter and slam down my uh, headset here as I can't <sighs> Exactly. Up. I mean, it's this is just a nerve wracking type game. Better spots on the card, but you're right. If you start getting yeah. that, I mean, what is it, 20 and a half minus 120? So you'd have to pay some juice for yep. the 19 and a half. But uh, it, it's a little bit interesting here. Keep an eye. And, and another way to keep an eye on this game, that Dolphins team total, if you can get that to 20 and a half or 19 and a half and pay the juice. If you're going to have all these injuries on the Colts, if Darius Leonard is limited or unable to play, that Colts, that front line of the Colts defense gets exponentially worse. This song reminds me of Juvenile. That song, Slow Motion for Me. This is going to be a slow motion uh, game. I like it like, I like that. that. Exactly. Put that jam on. If you're having a bad day, throw that one on on slow Spotify. Slow motion for me. Love that song. Let's yeah, with slow motion and offense, I think, on both sides yeah. of that. Because when I try to take a look at team totals, you want splash plays, explosive plays. It just seems like both of these teams labor up and down the field. So it's a tough one. But again, when they labor up and down the field, that's why you can get a 19 and a half and not a 24 right. and a half or 26 and a half. 